This is from Herd Amid the Guns, True Stories from the Western Front by Jacqueline Carmichael. In his place, some were meant to be soldiers and some weren't. That's what Milunka Savich thought, so she pretended to be her brother. When the Serb army called the lad up, she went disguised as him, in his place, the original Hunger Games with a great war twist. Alas, her gender was uncovered literally when she was wounded and a doctor prepared to treat her. Savage asked to return to the field. Her commanding officer, annoyed perhaps that a woman had walked in men's ranks in stealth, said he'd answer her tomorrow. I'll wait, she said, not budging, just waiting. Rifle straight, embodying guts and chill. After an hour of her standing there, how unnerving was that? Her commanding officer grudgingly agreed she could stay in the army. Good call. The odds were ever in her favor. Milunka Savich went on to become the most decorated female fighter in the history of warfare, period. In 1916, she captured 23 Bulgarian soldiers by herself. Hers are the French Légion d'Honneur, twice, the Cross of St. George, the Most Distinguished Order of St. Michael, English, and the Serbian Milos Obelic Medal. She was also the only female recipient of the Croix de Guerre, French, with the palm attribute. After a brief marriage and having a child, she went on to adopt two orphans. For the icing on the cake, in the Second World War, she was invited to attend a prestigious dinner with occupying Nazis. She refused. For that, she earned 10 months in jail. Milunka Savic lived a long life, dying at age 81. There's a street in Belgrade named for her.